What is up, everybody? This is Hudson. Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. I know I've been really bad at uh, uploading stuff recently, but but having some life stuff creep up on me. But on a positive note, check this out. Hell yeah, Scariest Elk actually sent me a whiteboard uh, from Amazon. So thank you so much. You actually went down into the description of the video, found my P.O. box, ordered something on Amazon and had it sent there, and I got it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. This is awesome. Uh, we can start writing things down like for real. I, I need to get back into the game to realize what we were trying to do. Because you should start with the ultimate goal on the bottom and then work your way up from there. What you need to do. Uh, and, then, and then when you actually do it, you work top down. All right, now I've got uh, power, so we need the hydrogen generator, which is going to make heat. We have to deal with that well, from the electrolyzer, but we need the water pump to pump into the electrolyzer, and then it's going to make the, you know, the gross water. So that maybe I should write that, right? Doesn't it make um, polluted water? I think so. So that's something we got to deal with. Uh, and then algae or air. We want air, but we want to go get the algae from the slime zone. But then we need an exosuit. And then I think to make an exosuit, we're going to need the granulizer. I think. Granulizer. Or granulator, or whatever that thing is. Um, to make the good refined metals. And I think that's where, like, we're going to have to, like, figure that out. So I'll just, like, reference that. I don't have a place to, like, hang it. I'm just going to put it on the floor next to me. And, uh, hopefully that'll do the trick. We're also trying to make this battery base over here. So we're going to try to get the batteries up and running and we're going to try to charge them with these wires. See if we can't get a, a pretty significant amount of power stored away over here. And with that power stored away, we can then cut off the power and get this thing running on its own. Because the hydrogen generator should be able to power up the gas filter, the gas pump up here, uh, the electrolyzer and the water pump. I think, maybe, uh, on its own power here, and should just go and even if it only powers this section up here, we will be able to make oxygen. We will be able to make oxygen, um, and pump that into the base, so this, even like I said, even if it's the, the hydrogen generator is capped, maxed, it's still doing a good thing. We'll have to maybe, like, somehow eventually make another hydrogen generator. I don't know how much... Like, maybe we're going to be making more hydrogen than we're actually using from the hydrogen generator. And we could stick a second hydrogen generator in this little spot, in this zone. So, like, maybe that could be a thing. Hang on a second. My brother's going to come over and help me with some renovation stuff tonight. So, I had to tell him, definitely come over right now before I missed it and forgot about it. Who's idling? Bert. <laughs> You son of a... Okay, let's just do a check. As always, oxygen looks fantastic. Vitals, get the hell out of here. Uh, stress levels are pretty high. Bert's pretty high, but everyone's immune system is good. 42% uh, stress levels. Is there anything I can do for you, Bert? It's probably because he's holding his breath. Uh, drab decor. Idle, does that do anything? No. And he's grimy. Everyone is grimy. Get over it, Bert! He's also stuck. He's stuck. He stuck himself over there. You're holding your breath, and now you're literally going to die. Am I- am I getting that correct? I think I'm getting that correct. I think I'm gonna say- I'm gonna say nine, I think. I think I'm gonna go ahead and- yeah, I'm gonna do that, I think. Uh, yeah. I don't know why you did that. Especially while you're holding your breath. That's not the smartest thing you've ever done, Bert. You know, you've done stupider things. You've done worse things, but, uh, you know? <laughs> You're such an idiot! Oh man, food is decayed. The pepper nuts are just going rotten. No one likes rotten nuts, dude. What are these things? Blam lily seeds. Do I care about them? It's in carbon dioxide right now, is it? No, it's oxygen in here. This was running for a little bit, but I turned it off. Um, because I don't want to maybe overload the, the power systems. We're, we're currently cooking. I think we were choosing to either cook or turn on and make some oxygen, but like, we're doing fine. It's complaining about oxygen, but look, look, just look. And these things are cutting through, they're cutting through the uh, carbon dioxide a little bit. Carbon dioxide's mildly taking over, it's gonna destroy life as we know it, but I mean, other than that, other than that, it's fine, you guys, whatever. How much food do we have, 30,000? You think I'm worried about this? How's the heat death of the universe coming along? It's pretty cold in here. It's like really cold in here. Oh gosh, it's super cold in here. Cold enough? 
No, these need uh, 41, they're 44, right? That's the temp ship plate. Let's collect the sleet wheat. The sleet wheat itself is 43.5. So, things are happening, especially now that they're not coming in and out of that door. But we are getting some leakage by that door. Why can't we just have an insulated door? Why can't that just be a thing? Why can't the door just be insulated? Huh? We also, uh, I made a planter box. It needs to be in a flower pot, so let's just... No, nope, don't disable it. No, nope, don't disable repairs. Deconstruct, Jesus. Destroy it! Roto! Cast it into the fire. The batteries! Whoa! Suck on that, everybody who says I don't do anything in an episode! Like, what is this? Five minutes in, we have three batteries! Six minutes in, we're gonna have four batteries. Yeah, you can suck on that. Mmm. Victory sip. Victory sip. We're gonna need that transformer, like, soon. Soonish. And these things are gonna take about 14 years to charge up, so we'll just kinda, like, wait on that. I like how they're surrounded with ice and, uh, and liquid, liquid, uh, chlorine. I hope that, that cools them down significantly. It's minus 25. These things heat up, though, especially when they're in the same area. I probably could have put, like, two over here. And I still could. Still could put two over there. Probably will. Sounds like a good idea to me. Like I said, we're gonna eventually, I think, want to, uh, open up this whole area so that when these anti-entropy nullifier doohicker bobs are, are running, they can, uh, cool down this entire area. Somebody mentioned in the comments section, they said I should be taking my air from my base, and I should be pumping it over all the way over here, right past the anti-entropy thermal nullifier, uh, and then having that air pump through this way, and then come all the way back. Are they gonna heat up, though? I would make the, the pipes coming to and from the hot areas uh, insulated, and then when it reaches the cold area, it would turn into a non-insulated pipe that allows heat to exchange freely. Loop around maybe a little bit, going like beep, 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 I mean, that would be a lot to build, but if we had this oxygen checkpoint or exosuits, easy. Go boop, 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 Scatman, and then it comes all the way back and uh, pumps right back in. And that only, t it's, gonna, it's gonna take one gas pump. No, no matter how long the pipe is, one gas pump to do all that without any amount of what are the things that I'm thinking of? Without any amount of. Plumbing, ventilation to be across this one. Without any amount of, of thermal regulators. Because this is something that you have, to pa uh, you have to pump gas into, it cools it down, and then it makes heat in its vicinity, you know, stuff like that. Oh, hey, I found the one thing that I was looking for. The Atmos sensor becomes active or standby when gas pressure enters a chosen range. So, um, yeah, we could have it so that when there is enough hydrogen, this kicks on and uh, turns on the hydrogen generator and just doo -doo 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 until there's no hydrogen left and then it shuts off. Or we could have it so that um, uh, that we have a, a, a pump that uh, handles the oxygen in here and turns on when the oxygen gets to a certain um, pressure. And then it goes, thump, it dumps the oxygen into our base and then shuts off until the pressure rises again. And these are some kind of ways that we can go about um, not having things run all the time because we don't need them to run all the time. You know what I mean? Unless the pressure is just always going to be up all the time, in which case it'll be going on all the time, in which case I can just go ahead and fudge the numbers of the sensor all the time, and uh, that would be fine too. I just, you know, I'm throwing ideas out there. <coughs> half of these, half of these going to stick to the wall. 25% of those, again, are just going to slip right off the wall. But we're going to be left with some really sticky shit right on the wall. A bunch of just goop. That'll be uh, really nice. The stickiest shit gets the worm. I think that my grandma used to say that. I'm pretty sure it's accurate. A bird in the bush is worth two sticky shits on the wall. That's another one that she used to say. Same thing, though. All on the same lines. Okay. So, batteries. When the batteries are in. When the batteries are in. When the batteries are in. Who's getting the batteries? When the batteries are in. Somebody said that I can go ahead and, and take uh, Turner off the sous chef. And he can uh, have a different job. Right? While retaining all the skills that he got. 
Because he does have a lot of skills, right? He's got, uh, let's see here, cooking seven. But he is going to lose the, uh, let's see here, further increasing duplicates cooking skills. If he's a, sh he's a cook, if he's the chef, he has better abilities, I think. So that's, that's, you know, nice. And I can put him on something else. You know, is cooking that important? I don't know if he can cook, like, really, really quickly. And then he can get to other tasks really quickly. He cooks less quickly. What does Turner, what would he like to do? Does he, does he have an interest in something? No, excuse me. No. Okay, like, can I just, can I just, can you just? Harold, like, there we go. I figured it out. Turner, I don't think, I could just look at Turner, right? Just, no, I didn't want to fucking do, God, ah, I can't. I can't handle this menu in any way, shape, or form. Turner, what the f is your interest, okay? Can you talk to me? Gender X. Turner is like, I don't like to identify, okay? So don't even. This Turner is paralyzed by the knowledge that others have memories and perceptions of them they can't control. You're not helping me. You're not helping me. Personal interest. He likes to cook. He loves cooking. You want me to take him off his, his dream job? That is his, he loves it. He loves it so much. Maybe he should be an engineer. What else is Turner good at? And what do we need? Cooking is not that important, but... Tinkering is good. Athletics is super good. So he could be a runner. He could be a... Golfer. He could be a golfer. You know, we could just sign him up to be, to be a, a good uh, golfer. What else is there? You have 100%. Should you be exosuit engineer? That seems a little intense to go from a courier to an exosuit engineer. Like a guy who literally delivers pizza, and then you're like, you're gonna, you're in charge of like, fucking, this is like Armageddon all over again. Most underqualified dude doing the most intense fucking thing that you've ever imagined, saving the entire planet. As long as you're willing to kill yourself at the end, Harold. <laughs> Spoilers! Hello, I haven't seen Armageddon yet. You just completely spoiled the movie huts. Miner, do we need miners? Do we need something to dig? Architects, do we need a builder? We maybe, you know what? Maybe we should just have another builder because holy crap, but we have like two people that just can't build at all. You guys are probably just like sitting over there like, what the hell are you doing? Huts, there's, there's more menus to, to look at all this shit. There's probably more menus to look at all this shit. I just don't know where they are. Auto prioritize, that just seems like a mistake. Unless it does it way better than I do it. Um, skills. Your thing. What? Can you build? Cannot perform build. Turner. That's maybe why you are cooking the pizzas that are then being delivered. By Harold. He looks like he's a pizza delivery boy! Don't even! Don't give me that. I don't- in the comment section? Come on. I got that stupid light in my eye. And one of these days I'm just literally just gonna staple up a sheet uh, to that window. I can't handle it. It hasn't happened until like the last month. I don't know if the sun was like, hey, I suddenly exist. And then my window's like, oh shit, I'm supposed to be letting that light through. Oh, let's start doing that. Slacking window shade piece of crap. Anyways, enough of my anger. Anger aside, let's maybe, uh, you know, it was a pretty important rant, I think, so time well spent. Gosh, Huts, you haven't done anything! I got the batteries in. I can literally blow the entire rest of this episode just ranting about nothing. I think I've bought myself that. I don't even know if I've coughed once, so you guys really need to start appreciating what you have. Alright? I might call you guys chat just because it's like secondhand nature when I'm dealing with Twitch people, but you guys are technically the comment section. But, like,. You're also just viewers, because if you didn't leave a comment, then you're not the comment section. You're just a general viewer. But and then I'm talking to the people who are actually getting mad and saying shit, which is only available in the comment section. I don't know. Let me write that down on the whiteboard. Oh, goodness. Seriously, though, you guys, I love, 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 love presents. I love getting presents so much. It's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Scariest Elk. That was super cool. Sometimes I like, like, sometimes I'll get into like a binge where I order a bunch of stuff on Amazon, right? And I get packages like every the day and I'm like, <laughs> and I open it up. I don't care if it's like the butt wipes. 
You know, I'm like super excited to get a package. It's like a little mini present. And then like sometimes when I, I stop ordering things, I feel like I should order things just so that I get to feel the joy of opening a package. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, I'm pathetic. It's all right. Some people were saying that uh, they walk right by the wash basin and they don't wash their hands, and that's a huge problem. But I don't think that is. I think they only wash their hands if they need to. And then some people were saying that they, they don't wash their hands if someone's washing their hands currently. They just walk on by because they're like, oh, I can't wash my hands then. I don't, I don't know if that's true. Because look at the germs. There's no germs here except for in this. Why is there germs in this? What did you do? What did you do? Is there rotten? Maybe there's a rotten something in here or something. Bleach stone? No, that, that should be, uh... That, since there is bleach stone in there, it should be fine. Sand? Why are you... Gross. I have no idea. Anyways, that's where there are some germs. Everyone's immune system is fantastic. We have, uh... Plenty of medicine still. Feels good, though. I feel just fine. Insufficient oxygen generation. Oh, the battery's on. Okay. Um. Uh. Yeah. Turn turn the power on. E. You know, if I let's let's just say, let's just say that we disable the food, and we disable enable. That's already disabled. We disabled some things, right? So that we can go ahead and turn this on without overpowering it, because it's gonna start turning these on. Not necessarily what I'd like to do, but we do have some of these just disabled, disabled. That's enabled. This can have a wee, uh, a wheeze wart. Put one in there, please. And this can also have a wheeze wart, please. The slate wheat, it's not necessary. We're making so much food, it's it's fine. But if we're able to get the slate wheat, pump out that really, really good shit, then we can just like, just forget about it, pump everybody up to like the, the biggest task they could possibly get on. Did I just like leave Turner without putting him anywhere? He's unemployed, which is not good. It makes him sad. Um. That's not good. How many people are yelling at me because of that? I guess he could just be a golfer. His athletics are through the flipping roof. Fine, whatever. I mean, I gotta put him on something. If he's not gonna be a, a chef, I mean, I turn the chef stations off. So it would make sense not to have him do that, so. Am I gonna overload the system? Can we can we look at uh what, what, what we got going on here? Deoxidizer, we have one of those. Research station, we're not researching. Micro musher, we're not mushing. Ceiling lights on. Supercomputer not gonna be used. Massage table is not gonna be used. No, nope, no, yes, no, no. Like we're we're not running anything at all. Let's turn that sucker on. Let's turn that sucker on. And then they're of course gonna go to bed, so that if something did go wrong, they're not gonna get to it until the morning. That's starting to start pumping. These are gonna start uh, absorbing energy. Hold on, take a break. Let's just double check. Hold it. Um, a safe wattage 1000, and we're at power produced 800. Power produced. I'm generated by this circuit. I'm not generating anything, okay. How much is going through it, though? Power generator, circuit overview, power produced, power consumed. 375, that's the number I'm looking at right there. Just want to make sure there's not something funky that goes on with the batteries. Like, there should be no power generated from them, but, like, there's power in them connected to the circuit. So, Master Turner? Nails. I was like, if Turner is already a Master Goffer, which wouldn't surprise me if the athletics are 10, right? That would make sense to me. Is everybody in their beds? Do we only have seven people? I should probably know that. There's a, there's a number in the top. Population. There's also uh, stress levels up here. <coughs> it tells me the highest person is at 44%. It tells me the immune system is at 100%. I should just look at these numbers. Bert's just an angry person. Bert's just not not good. As soon as Bert gets to 50, it's going to warn me about him. And his health's probably going to go down a little bit too. Okay. If these can start going up, that's a good thing. If they never go up ever, clearly a bad thing. We should probably start putting on the hydrogen generator. Now, the pipes were uh, hooked up wrong last time. This will be filtering out hydrogen, and the hydrogen needs to go... Uh, yeah, the orange is hydrogen. Whatever it's filtering, filtering out, and it is hydrogen. The rest of it, pump right into the base, right out of this vent right here. 
as you can see if I put the ventilation back on. Perfect. Okay. Now, this is not going to ever get to the oxygen, which is why I said we should honestly move this um, gas pump to, like, right here. This would be the optimal spot right there, I think, um, to get a little bit of both so that we not only can um, fuel up the hydrogen generator, but we can also pump oxygen into the base with one 240 energy, right? Is that gas pump 240? So here's the problem. Uh, the wattage on the circuit right now is at 135, 200, 495. I did see a 495 in there. Now, I don't know what that was. Toggling electrolyzer on and off. Toggling oxidizer on and off. It's going to make me twitch. It's going to make my eyeballs twitch. Why did I get up to 490? I'm watching and I'm not seeing anything else happen. Liquid pump. Is it the liquid pump? Is the liquid pump waiting to pump liquid? It's on, right? Pipe blocked. It's waiting on the uh, the oxidizer to, to, to... Yep, 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 yep. That's the one. Uh, 490 plus 240 plus 120. You can handle that. You can handle that. So let's turn on the gas pump and the filter. And then uh, power up the... Oh my gosh, the batteries are like... Oh, okay. No, 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 no. That's fine. The batteries are totally handling it. Okay. Uh, this is what we do then. We curse the sun for getting in my face. Then, and only then, are we going to cut this, hook up our uh, power... Power transformer. Hook up our power transformer. It needs a three base, apparently. I, I don't know. Does it really need a three base like this? But then again, this wire system is just completely messed up too, and I'm not even sure if it's gonna it's gonna gonna do the thing it's supposed to do. Maybe like up the priority here. Let's 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 build those. Let's get to the bottom of this, the top of this, the center of this. Do we have any more uh, fungal spores to plant? Nope. Why would I put something into a farm tile? And out of planter box. Well, you could lower it down one. You could have the floor made of farm tile. But you can't insulate the farm tile unless you make the farm tile out of insulated material. We also have deodorizers that we could totally be using. Like, how much sand do we have? Where is that even? Consumable ore? Filtration medium? 112 uh, tons of sand? Could, uh... Just put some deoxidizers, or what, what were they called? Deodorizers? Deodorizers right in here to scrub this polluted oxygen out of the way. So it doesn't slip into the base, but... You know, there's a little bit. There's a little bit floating around in here. You can see the green stuff. I'm not uh, terribly concerned about it. I'm not even, like, super concerned about it, okay? We have three people idling. People uh, just don't know what to do. Let's go ahead and start building more things. It's because we're not building anything. We're not researching anything. We're just going to hang in tight. We're, we were waiting, though. We were definitely waiting to see what was going to happen. So let's uh, build the transformer. Does the transformer itself take power? Wire. Deconstruct. Boop, 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 boop. Deconstruct that. And that should be it. Right? That should do it. Like that. So that this this is no longer pumping over here. We just cut this whole system. But it is no no no, it should still be pumping because it's still connected to the batteries that still have tons of power. Let's check that uh thermal. I mean if you if it got hot already, well <laughs> it just jumped ship. Oh it's working! Oh no 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 no, what's going on? What is this? How much how much is on this side? They actually built it. Okay, it needs three spots in the bottom. It was not clear to me because there was like shit down here. Okay, on the sprite, and it looked like it didn't it didn't want that. All right, so I airflow tile is good because it'll allow maybe heat to dissipate. This thing's gonna generate lots of heat, I think. Let's just see what it says before we let that thing run too much. Heat plus five watts. That's not that bad actually. Maybe even unnoticeable. Maybe. We should probably clear out that area underneath it and just have it sitting on 
this airflow tile. That's that's kind of what I'm thinking. So let's like this. Boop boop boop. Shoobity boop. No, is it is it X or C? Is cancel X is deconstruct. Yes, please. It just didn't show it on that tab. Oh, there's tons of algae that's dropping into the cliff. Uh, that's that's actually not that big of a deal. Just dig over to it. Whatever, man. Turner's trapped. Yep. Such is the life of an idiot. Ladders are also uh, good ways to. Yeah, you are such an idiot. Please build that. He's like literally like sitting right next to people like, bang. like just make the jump, okay? Sure, it's risky, even if you broke your leg. You just sit on the, the bed for a little bit. Nails is now supple. Ah! Why? Can you jump on that? You can jump over there on that, on that, on that. Priority nine. Oh, you thank God you can build nails. <laughs> oh, you're such an idiot. What is going on, nails? <laughs> I was gonna say you're killing me. You are killing you. You are killing you. Nobody is responsible for this. Okay, the power stuff though, I think that's all settled. I think we can honestly turn this sucker on. We're just we're just wasting away this battery juice. Let's turn it on. We can, we can overload the crap out of this side because it's all heavy. No, it's not. Fuck. <laughs> no, it's not! Wait, 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 wait. Is there a control Z? Can I undo what I just did? Disable building again. Leave it disabled. Undo enable. Redisable. Power. Heavy watt wire. What is this? <laughs> I didn't put the rest of the heavy white wire down here. <laughs> I'm coughing. My bad. You're right. I have coughed a little bit. Oh. 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 Because we're fucked. Is why. I think we don't have enough. I think we don't have enough on this power system over here to make a difference. To make a difference. Wire bridge that shit, dog. Yo, dog! Wire bridge that shit! Like this! Boop, 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 boop! Wait, control Z again. Cancel, 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 cancel the dancing girls. We wanna go up to the... that. What am I doing? Literally, what the hell am I doing? Deconstruct that wire. This is slop. This is sloppy. I'm working around my old systems. And I should just be making new systems. We should just update the systems. We should just update the, the damn systems. But I'm not going to, because I'm too stubborn. I'm too stubborn to do that, all right? Dude, we have so much hot. 2,000 hydrogen. Max gas pressure, yeah. That's correct, One, almost 2,000 of oxygen. You need to settle down. You need to stop, sir. Batteries are doing great, though. Batteries doing fantastic. It's, uh, the batteries are heating up a little bit, you can tell, because it's turning this uh, liquid chlorine into uh, gaseous chlorine. Circuit overloaded, what, 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 what? Where? This circuit. Circuit status, 5,000 watts. Max wattage, 1,000. Power transformer, 5 kilowatts. I'm not sure how or why. But that's gonna blow everything up. I understand the idea that the, the power transformer steps down the power 
but if I hook up both sides of it and there's not 5,000 watts coming into it, tell me there's not 5,000 watts on you. How, how is the power transformer itself generating 5,000 kilowatts? Yeah, that's, you have the right face, Nicola. You absolutely have the right face. I don't understand it either. How is it generating five kilowatts? Overload damage, overload damage, overload damage, overload damage, overload damage, overload damage, overload damage. I hate everything. Everything is not awesome. And we're not part of a team. Circuit's still overloaded. Is it though? Power consume 135. 135. It went away. It went away. <laughs> it knew better. It's like, I'm sorry. You're right. My bad. There's no way in hell that the, the transformer should be generating 5,000. All it does is it works with the power coming into it. Increasing or decreasing power flow. Well, if I knew that it could just immediately generate 5,000 kilowatts, then uh, we don't need any power generators. It's generating power. This is fantastic. This is good news. Turner is now idling because Turner is a piece of shit. Uh, but it's not Bert. It's not Bert. So we can all be thankful for that. We don't have any tasks for them to go do, to run and get. Have we explored all the lockers? No lockers. There's only two lockers that we even know about. We still need to get down to the security door down here. So, um, Turner actually doesn't build. Can Turner dig? I think Turner can dig. Can you dig it? Well, did we, did we do everything? I'm thinking about maybe making a task to come up here and uh, get these wheeze warts. That would seem like a worthwhile thing to do. Like that. And then like a ladder. Let's make some like ladders and stuff, man. Like all the way up. That's sick, bruh. And then I want you to uproot this shit. And then I want you to dig down to this guy. And you can also get this sleet wheat while you're there. That'll be pretty cool and stuff. Alright. Sweet. That'll uh, blaze the trail to get up to this other anti entropy thermo nullifier. 32 minutes in, you guys! Our time is so short together. Just make hour long episodes. A lot of people will complain about that too, though. All right, they uh, did the stuff that they needed to do. Now, what does our power system look like? Like a big old pile of shit. So what we were gonna do is uh, route the wire over here, up, and then down. Why are we using iron ore? Maybe we should use iron ore. I, I don't know. It's heavy watt shit. What's the iron ore? What does it do? Decor, minus 25? Max power, plus 20. No, it's the same. This decor with the, uh... Yeah, it's bullshit. Doesn't matter. Can you upgrade that wire? Can you upgrade that one? You can't upgrade that one. Fair enough. Unless you were going to. Doesn't look like it. Okay, break that stuff, turn it into better wire. And then uh, this side of the, the whole system will be able to handle, right? Max watt is 20K, and if it steps it up to 5K for some unimaginable reason, I don't even know what's going on. You could step up volts and lower the amperage, vice versa, to maintain wattage, but I don't think you can just create 5,000 watts out of thin air. Secret to uh, long-lasting energy. Just found it. Just found it. Nicola, I'm not sure why you decided to idle there. I'm not sure why you did that. Is your thing to build? Do you like building? Because you, I've got things to build that you could build that are not in a freezing zone that doesn't have any oxygen in it. Unless you just trapped yourself, which doesn't look like it. Um, yeah, no, you have things that you, like, you could be doing. Which is uh, like, like another flower pot over here for heat. And that's gonna be pretty important. We put another Wii Sport in. Look at that. Oh, man. So proud. 
Still the sweet wheats are like, mm, nah, I'm not having it. One degree above. Hey! Look at you, big guy! That's fantastic. That is great. I'm such a proud dad. I mean, I'm a little pissed off, but what dad doesn't get pissed off a little bit here and there? These batteries are hanging on to their shit pretty well, might I add. What's your temperature? Minus 6, and it's about minus 19, minus 30, minus 40, minus 50. <laughs> They're generating heat. Minus 17 over here. Well, yeah, maybe we should have spaced them out a little bit more. But, cross that bridge when we get to it. We could have, can we have a gas valve that like goes here or there? We could just have it go to both places and have a turn off on each one. Or just have it go to both places and just keep pumping, right? Because we could pump hydrogen. When this is not running, just pump that hydrogen over here to the anti-entropy thermo nullifier. Say that 10 times fast. It might not be that hard. I don't know. People are idling and like we should probably be doing stuff. Uh, food is still phenomenal. Slate wheats are starting to grow in, which is uh, super cool. Um, everything's hooked up. Everything's hooked up. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna like enable this and just cross my fingers and hope to die. It looks like big power, little power, right? Tell me you're overloaded. No power. No power. What the hell's going on? What the hell's wrong with you, boy? Oh, that's right. We tried to upgrade those two pieces and it didn't work. No, we, we saw this coming. Can't go through tile, which is why it didn't upgrade it. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Definitely agree with that. There's no in and out of a heavy watt joint plate. Then I know of. You should be able to just replace that, please. Make that happen. Oh, you know, go, no, 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 go to bed. Go to bed, fine, you wanna be tired? Great. Why don't we just cash in? Why don't we just not make food? Why don't we all just sleep? Ugh. Oh, two. Talk to me. It's a little low over here. Doing fine. Should we like pump different gas into this area? Should it not be oxygen? There's so much oxygen in there. Are the Weezworts generating oxygen? No, it's just there's so much oxygen everywhere. We're doing so flipping well in oxygen. There's even oxygen that like made it all, all the way up here. Goodness. Feel pretty good. This Weezworts struggling though. It's like, Argh! help. I can't. Nobody should be idling. We're, we're doing stuff and things. I wish you could just tell it. Like, make a wart seed when you when you get one. You know? Pre-order that shit. This is working. Status on this side. Still good. Now, this does only work one way. So, the batteries are going to run out. And we're not actually having the ability to supply the batteries again. So we have to get the the frip the frippin fripping? Oh, son of a frip, dude. What the frip am I even talking about? We gotta get this thing up and running now. Um, and we should be able to do that. We should be able to enable everything. We don't need to enable that just yet. We're, we're good on that. Power is, is connected to the water pump, which is gonna be pumping it up to this thing. There. That's that's whoa 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 ventilation. Let me let me see the hydrogen coming in. Are you pumping it? Are you pumping it? Are you pumping it? Is this gonna start going to power up the the batteries again? Oh! You never do anything in any episodes, do you? Nope. I've never done anything. My success. I just had nothing. Nothing's ever gotten done. You're still pumping gas into it though. Does it really take that much? It's just trickling. It's trickling. That's phenomenal. It doesn't need very much gas at all. The gas pump is like, yeah, it's good. I don't know. <laughs> that thing opens up. It looks like a little frog. It looks like a little frog that's sitting on the side of the ladder. He's like, burp. Burp. I mean, if that frog was going to make a noise, it'd probably sound something derpy like that. Look at him. 
Is that two little eyes? It's definitely a frog. If you don't see that, then I think you might be broken. Are we over, over overloaded? What's the load on this side? 0.38. Let's just like try to pause, freeze frame it when it's high. I can't freeze frame it when it's high. 3.8. This side, 1.35. So we've separated the two circuits. It's gonna be much higher on this side, and it's gonna be much lower on this side. We're doing it. It's working. All this like crazy stuff that we're uh, putting to use. Yeah, it feels pretty good though. Oh, the batteries! You know what? You need to you you need to figure out when you need to stop um stop going. You're just pumping you're pumping the hydrogen, you're pumping power into nothing. Priority like really high on that. If that thing if that needs to turn off or something, you need to figure that out. Okay. So, uh lettuce I love lettuce. Uh, cabbage is is pretty good too. Now, let us figure out what we're going to do about the battery situation. Well, the battery situation is quite clear that um, we need to go towards a smart battery, stores most runoff power from generators, uh, logic input becomes active when charge is above threat set threshold. So, when the batteries, the smart batteries are full, we, uh, <clears throat> we have it send a signal to uh, turn off the hydrogen generator, but hydrogen generator does not have an active logic input to it. So that means power shut off automatically turns off power using automated. No, it doesn't. It doesn't require power. We shut off the gas pump because it's still going to have a bunch of gas lined up that it's just going to waste in the power that runs off into nothing. Because that thing doesn't know when to stop. It just keeps burning it up. And, and if the power can't be stored somewhere. <laughs> right? Because it wasn't turning off. And the batteries were full. How do we How do we make sure that we turn off the goddamn thing? Weight plate. Germ sensor. Clock sensor. There's got to be an auto hydrogen plant shut off. Some way to do that. Signal switch. Automation grid. Maybe there is an automated put input into it. How the hell do I know? Power. So this has to be something that I just like look into in my own, maybe. Requirements, gas intake pipe, power, auto inputs, enable, disable. It does have an auto input. We just don't have the ability to look at the auto overlay because I have never researched it. Automation overlay. Let's go for that right now. That is what we're going to do. We're gonna set that up so that the, uh, the hydrogen plant shuts off when we, the smart batteries are at a certain charge level, right? Automation wire bridge, no. I'm just trying to like see if there's any other way that we could do that with currently using our, our battery setup. Is there another way? Hydro sensor, because like, I just built four really big batteries and if I have to disable those big batteries, that's gonna be stupid. But then again, we could plop some smart batteries in between them um, turn these ones off and then put some smart batteries over here on this side space them out a little bit more clear out those areas out the whole like Whatever temperature Solves itself Maybe even put a couple over here space them like really far out so that we never have to worry about that ever again And that's what we're probably gonna end up doing in the next episode water's fine our edibles are super fine our slate wheats are all growing Seeds 210 point. How do we have a 0.91919 of a sleet wheat? Right. Sure. I at first I thought that said 210,000, but that's not correct. Um, 52 sleet wheats. That is, that is something else. We're in good shape. Oxygen is, is fantastic. Algae would be the thing that we'd have to worry about. And it's 6.7 tons. So we're like at like five tons a few episodes ago. Um, and there's there's still more to go that we can easily reach without having to get an exosuit into the slime zone. So, yeah. And, and we're pumping so much oxygen in here that we need to get rid of. It's down to 815. Is that because the oxygen is spread out because of the hydrogen? We took that out? Or is the oxygen getting somewhere? Maybe it's leaking. I think it's probably leaking past these doors and stuff. Which is fine, I guess, as long as this chlorine doesn't come in. Anyways, 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode. Once again, thank you so much, Scariest Elk, for the uh, whiteboard. We haven't used it too much in this episode, but we've been pretty contained with what we're what we're doing. You know, our, our reach right now has been pretty small, and we reached it, so I feel pretty good about that. Like I said, see you in the next episode, you guys. Bye.